Hey guys, welcome back, Bolt Spider here, and today we are going over the new support that was just revealed in the new Duelist Pack, the Earth Duelist Pack, and it is Isiju's support, or I think I'm saying that incorrectly, I am bad with character names sometimes, but one of the reprints is Exchanges of Spirits. Now let's get into it. First up, we have our lovely friend Keldo, the Divine Priest of Lodging, it's an Earth Fairy, level 4, effect, 1200 defense and 1600, or 1200 attack, 1600 defense, and you can only use each effect of Keldo once per turn. You could discard one other Earth Fairy monster, special summon this card from your hand, and then add one exchange of spirit or one card that matches it from your deck to your hand. Once per turn, quick effect, you can banish this card from your field or graveyard, target up to three cards in your graveyard, or if exchange of spirits is on your field or in your graveyard, target up to five cards instead shuffle them into the deck so this card revolves around exchange of spirit and i think all the rest of the supports going to be going around that overall i don't think these are going to be good next up we have the new midoriya this is midora the sword priest it's a level four earth fairy 1500 attack 1800 defense and you can only use each effect once per turn you can discard one other earth fairy monster special summon this card from your hand then you can place one Gravekeeper's Trap from your deck face up in your spell and trap card zone. So this can get some Gravekeeper spell or Grave Gravekeeper's Traps for free. Once per turn, quick effect, you can banish this card from your field or graveyard. Then target up to three cards in your graveyard or if Exchanges Spirit is on your field or in your graveyard, you can target up to five cards instead and shuffle them into the deck. So Medora and Keldo both share the same effect for the second effect. And overall, I don't think these are going to do anything. As next up, we have Agoidi, the Ancient Sentinel. It's a level 4 Earth Fairy, 1500-1300. With the effect of, if this card is sent from the hand or deck to the, your opponent's... If a card is sent from the hand or deck to your opponent's graveyard, you can special summon this card from your hand. Then if you do, special summon one level 4 earth fairy monster from your graveyard except a goidi the ancient sentinel so this card reacts to hand traps and it also reacts to brave adventurer engine type stuff and if this card is sent from your hand or deck to the graveyard you can send the top five cards of each player's decks to the graveyard then if exchange of spirits is in your graveyard you can send the top five cards of either your opponent's deck or to the graveyard so it's a mill five and then it can mill another five more so we are looking at an exchange of spirit mill deck it's nothing really that matters in my opinion but we have gravekeeper's trap this is a card that you uh, activate off of medora the priestess and it's a continuous trap and you can only use the second and third effect once per turn when you have exchange of spirit in your graveyard your opponent cannot activate cards effects in the graveyard nor special shum yeah, special summon monsters from it during either player's main phase quick effect discard one card add a one gravekeeper or an earth fairy monster from your deck to your hand and if you control this face up card before your opponent draws during their draw phase declare one card name confirm that card drawn and if it is the card you declare send it to the graveyard so this references back to the episode where it's Isiju versus Kaiba and all that. That's where all this comes from, so bear with it. And the second effect of this card is very good because it adds a Gravekeeper monster from your deck to your hand. Next up, we have the Exchange of Hope. This is a normal trap card, and this is a reference to Exchange of the Spirits. And you could do other names like exchange of despair and hope or uh exchange of real world and underworld well exchange of despair and hope would be the actual name and you can only activate one copy of this card per turn if you control three or more earth fairy monsters you can send all monsters on the field to the graveyard and then both players get special summon a number of monsters excuse me from their opponent's graveyard up to the number of monsters their opponent sent to the graveyard through this effect to their owner's field. If you have an exchange of spirit in your graveyard, you 
can then set one trap card from your deck to the field. That trap can be activated the turn it is set. So pretty much this is a change of heart but weird where you can take your opponent's stuff and you can get your give stuff to your opponent but I really don't see this being played. It's more going to be a joke of all trade card so there is that. And finally we have Blast Held by Destiny. Um, This card overall definitely heavily references the anime as you can only use the first and second effect of this card once per turn. When your opponent declares an attack, you can destroy one monster with the highest attack your opponent controls and deal damage to your opponent equal to its original attack. If you don't have Exchanger of Spirit in your graveyard, you can then receive the same damage. Well, you then receive the same damage. And if this card is sent from your hand or deck to the graveyard, you can target one level 4 Earth Fairy in your graveyard and add it to your hand. Overall, this is very disappointing. For three Duelist packs total for the DM era that has tried to do stuff, it has just flopped. Duelist of the Abyss, the, the Mako Tsunami stuff is terrible. This stuff is bad, and Rage of Raw could be better. These cards could have been so good if they weren't centralized around exchange of the spirits. But I wonder what else is going to be in here because what's left is the Morphtronics support, Power Tool Dragon upgrade. But I want to know what you guys think about these cards as I'm very disappointed in this. But anyways, I've been Bolt Spider. See you guys in the next video and goodbye.